I grew up here in St. Louis. I've lived here all my life. You know, it's really fun as a St. Louis company to be working with another St. Louis company. I really liked what I was seeing from Studio M. It was really different, and I saw it in every nice store that I went into. So I called them, and I said, would you be interested in, you know, licensing with us? And luckily, that call went through to Ann Brown. Actually, when I called Studio M, I was thinking more of the flower pots, and doormats, and flags, and things like that. I hadn't even thought about fairies, and so when she brought that up, I just was really excited. Together we came to the idea of using the not fairy characters I had drawn, you know, girls who were outside playing or reading or gardening. We thought that would really be different and, than anything that's out there. So we developed the personalities first and then I drew the characters to go with that personality. Merriment is very contemporary. It's modern girls but still kind of old-fashioned in the way I draw. Everything that goes with them was taken out of drawings, every little watering can and animal and tree and plant. So it's very much my artwork that you'll see. Really wanted to get back into the independent market because I think that's where a lot of my customers shop. It's where I shop. Independent retailers really have their fingers on the pulse of whatever town they're in or their customer base. They're very personally involved in what they choose to sell, and so I'm always very proud if they choose my stuff. I think the Merriment line will just be fantastic because it hits all age levels. It's very different. It's different than anything we've ever put out, so it makes it really exciting. People are always looking for new things, and my fans are always looking for new things. We're just thrilled about this. I think it's going to make a splash.